numbers too big to ignore And I know too much to go back and pretend Good evening. Welcome to Joy of Women. This is your host, Joy Piscara. Ugarong gabi una, we'll talk about tourism. Tourism here in the city of Cebu and more particularly in the South Road properties or what we call SRP. And tonight, ang ato ang guest is um, the assistant marketing manager of El Curso Phil Invest Malls. Ato himamaton. Hanski Garcia. Hanski, good evening. Mayong gabi ipod ka ni Attorney Joy. And thank you very much for having me here in your show, The Joy of Women. Yes, oo. Kaya parang kuwan ba nga. Pero prior sa talking about tourism in that area sa SRP, but mangutana sa ko, Hanski, is it really ang imuha bang kurso nga gikuha sa college? Is it really related to marketing? Yes, attorney. Uh -huh. uh, I'm actually a graduate of Cebu Normal University, uh -huh. um, a Bachelor of Arts in Communication. Okay. So we actually have a ma uh, tri-major me, pero the, uh, we highlighted, uh, because before, um, Mahibawan is only journalism uh -huh. and broadcast. Okay. We also have integrated marketing communications and advertising. Ah. Okay, so, so naa sa day ang um, Cebu Normal University o koan ka ng uh, mass communication. Mm -mm. Okay, bitaw kay like mostly ang ako sa nadungan about um, Cebu Normal University like nursing, um, yes. yeah, education. Mm -hmm. So naa sa day mass communication. Yes, I think it's been almost 10 years and oh, okay. uh, uh, we are, are, we are. I came from the pioneer batch of Bachelor of Arts in Communication. Ah, okay. So we're the first batch to uh -huh. be offered with a degree of of communication, and then we also organized the Pista sa Puting uh, Cine Cine U Film Festival. Okay, so, so what is it about? We created a. Uh, it's a film festival for the students. Uh -huh. So even if you are not a major of, batch of communication and you wanted to explore filmmaking, uh -huh. so you can also submit your entries. Ah, really? Yes. Uh, so, <laughs> in a way, among students sa Cebu Normal University in um, um, Bachelor of Arts in Communication, parang in a way, well-rounded. Kaya parang mm. tanan nga aspeto sa parang ingunta sa uh, what you, mi social, uh, sa media, mm -mm. apilan ninyo. Uh, no. Yes, uh, we, are, we are also thankful for that opportunity nga na offer to sa Moang University. Uh -huh, uh, uh -huh. And yeah, I remember it was our, our departed, uh, she just recently died, si Dr. Esther Velasquez, ah, yes, yes. was uh -huh. a university president uh -huh. at who, the also, time. who was very supportive okay. of our degree. Uh, well, I, Everything in CNU, she's very supportive. She's one of our great uh, university president. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, anan bang uh, for, um, what's that, what you call this? In terming on tag sa BA uh, um, Bachelor of Arts in Communications, like when a marketing is it really because sometimes ba, people will think what's what's about ng marketing oh. ba? you know like oh, no, normal level ho na ho na marketing ah uh, mangumpra mm -hmm. oh, oh i said mm -hmm. marketing mangumpra or marketing is really like promotions um it's actually the creative side of business okay. uh, we support also uh everybody mga good things way back when i was a student everybody think marketing kailangan sales related yes. na. Uh -uh. so kailangan focus nga na ihalin kay para tungod ni marketing yes. which is partly true uh -huh. kay marketing is actually uh, the creative side of the business so mm -hmm. um, we create promotions content even events mm -hmm. and also um, relationships with okay. our uh, with so our clients. client uh -huh. dili lang siya focus on revenue generating <laughs> okay because uh -oh, but it's it, supportive uh -oh. mm -hmm. okay like i saw one time in um one of the videos uh facebook nga ningon na 
no, there are four important uh, divisions in a business. If you mm. create, you establish your own business. One is operations. Mm -hmm. Two, ang gibutang gudin yun. Number two, it's marketing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and iya pagaling separate ang marketing from sales, and then ikaupat ang finance. Last na ganing finance. So, uh -huh. para pagagigi emphasize yun sa katong uh, um, content uh, creator na importante ang marketing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because like ako before, so when I was in a, in a working in a corporation, ang um, giipon ra, although um, mm -hmm. in a de department, giipon ang sales and marketing. Yes. Uh, uh, so, ang sales o ka marketing, but then, one department sila, pero separate ga po division mm -hmm. ang marketing. Uh, so, like, on sa mga, on sa mga major nga difference between marketing and sales? Um, sa sales, mga good attorney, it's mm -hmm. basically revenue generation. Okay. Uh -oh, so, um, if there's a target for the sales, uh -huh. so kailangan nila na hit all the time. Okay. And for the marketing side, based on my experience, well, um, we made sure that uh, we support the sales on mm -hmm. what they needed. Okay. Diyan ang musod ang mga mga marketing collaterals. Ah, okay. So this is very creative, like uh, the uh, for the client to be uh, enticed to mm -hmm. go to to go uh, to buy your product. Uh -huh. Kailangan makakita sila. So we really, uh, we really have to um, attract the senses uh -huh. of the people that we are selling our product. Okay. Mapa, unsa pa siya nga business. Um, uh, mapa so, food, ba, mapa... Kinahanglan dyan ka, if you are in marketing, um, you are good also in creative design. Mm. Tinood. Okay. Uh -huh. like or you a, have an eye for, you, are, you have an eye for, of de, uh, eye for detail. Okay. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Kaya pa like, ah, kaya ba ka like mga, ka ng mga vlog. So it's really also a ma marketing. Yes. Uh -oh. Vogue is specializing in fashion marketing. Yes. So uh -huh. we're like, for the for the for these designers na mahalin ang ilahang mga uh, collections, uh -huh. so it has to appeal to the eye of the women. So. Um, what is the color of the season? Does it fit me very nicely? Okay. Why are we wearing this fashion? Yes, yes. So, uh -uh. It also, uh, ah, <laughs> <yeah. laughs> because we feel that uh, right. we feel the need, the need of it, not just the want of it. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. But do you know, ba here in our city, are there really a number of like what you call this nga? Uh, students uh, would really go and study marketing I or like communications? Um, I believe so. Mm -hmm. um, it really depends on the calling of, of the individual. Mm -hmm. uh, me, when I was, uh, when I was cho trying to choose what I wanted uh -huh. to do in my, <laughs> my career journey, because before at that time, nursing was really the most popular oh, degree. Yes, and yes. I came from a family of medical professionals too. Mm -hmm. So I, I'm, I, I feel like I'm kind of pressured to do so, uh -huh. aside from the other side of the family who's into <laughs> uh -huh. the politics. Okay. <laughs> so I was like, hmm, ni. So uh -huh. I'm always a creative person because I really like to draw. So what I had in my mind right at that time is, I will take fine arts. Uh -huh. I'm ah, so ready. You, so, so you love drawing? <laughs> yes. Uh -huh. I'm not very good at that time. Uh -huh. Okay, because, you know, we have uh, school requirements. Yes, Focus yes. Focus on the academic But I really wanted to explore that. So I'm ready with my brushes uh -huh. and then the pencils. Pencils are my favorite. Ah, mm -hmm. so you do also do sketching. Yes, but it's not perfect. Oh, yeah, but you know, sometimes, like, uh -huh. we start mm -hmm. from there. Yes. Diba, ang importante, it's, you have that interest. Yes. Yeah, nga, parang, ang sayo mo, ang, and that's also good, nga, you, like, you know, like, in choosing, uh, like, what you wanna take up, like, as a, as a profession, or a course, di ba nga, muna kay, muna kay foresight on, unsay mo yung buhaton mm. after college. Yes. Di ba kay, nayuban ba nga, like, sometimes mo, kwan lang nga, ah, kay akong classmate, nag, yes. ano, nag mm -hmm. nursing, mag nursing lang sa go, or unsa nga course, di ba, it's not really, o kung sa ilang gitanaw, o, mm. unsa may in the future, because, you know, there are so many people also nga, they took up, like, I have like you know, mm -hmm. uh, I I think you know Carlo Abaqueta, mm -hmm. uh, uh like, CI his uh, ano, uh, uh, Kwan siya, 
licensed nurse, oh, yes. registered nurse. And then eventually, um, what he wanted in life is really kind of events coordinator, wedding coordinator, di ba? So, it's really a matter of very important. Pero wag, along the way, sa imuhang journey, mm -hmm. pwede ka nga, mudritsu ka dritsu sa imuhang journey. However, there are also people nga, nag ni Scala pa, ni abot pag-asa sila na pita. Is, mm -hmm. Una pa sila na abot o asa gida pita ang ilang gusto in life. Yes, it's yes. not also a bad thing. There's yes. a lot of inspirational stories that we yes. heard that uh, some people find what they really want at the later part of life, but it's yes. never too late. At least you try. Yes, but... Uh, mm -hmm. I think si KFC, mm -hmm. <laughs> I forgot his real oh, name, yeah? Colonel oh. Sanders, Sanders yes, I think. Uh -huh. yeah. It's not really a colonel, you know. Yeah, so, alright. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, um, he he discovered uh, doing fast food chains later in life. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, beta, no? mm -hmm. So, like, like in your journey. Mm -hmm. But then, it's a good uh, for you that um, as a, a young age, you already have what you want also thinking uh, what you want to do mm -hmm. uh, related sa imuhang what you want. Yes, uh -huh. and you know, your attorney, some people are uh, very determined that from the very start mm -hmm. when they set their goals when they were young mm -hmm. nga, that's what they wanted to do yes. and there's no turning back because that's the path that they want to and they became uh, successful. successful with yes. it uh -huh. some people it's not also a bad thing that they the some people especially me uh -huh. i'm not really i didn't start uh, marketing uh -huh. uh, after graduation yeah i i moved to different industries hotel hotel mm -hmm. uh -huh. i became a hotelier and then a, I, tr I also ventured a tech company before I ended up in commercial retail management of Philanthe Smalls. Ah, okay. Mm. Ito, no? Kay line line tap, <laughs> like you, you're good uh -huh. nga. Na kay gusto ako sa kay on my, on my own journey kay parang a good, good daughter. Follow lang ang sa gisulti sa ginikanan. Yes. And then doing good what has been there. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. I know. Although my course nga pang gusto nga it's not really a uh, parag mga course nga available here in Cebu like mm -hmm. I want to take up geology. Wow. Yeah, I want to study the earth. In ano ba? They were like next I wanted to like take up uh kaning uh, chemistry. Oh my gosh. Yes, and then who <laughs> That's really in, good. In <laughs> nanen ko nga uh, it's not for women. Oh, at yes. that ta, yes, kay parang, that you know, kay, but you know, but you know, parang pag you're right, nga, we have different journeys, mm -hmm. uh -oh, but it's just really how we, we do, uh, or say nga, nga, do our best in that particular journey, mm -hmm. uh, di ba? And then eventually either you love it or maybe you find another, um, kanang course nga, you choose, or you think nga, would be good for you. Yes. Uh -oh, oh, it's, it's only the matter of, uh, be, uh, uh, timing is everything. Sometimes, yes. Mangod, you feel like uh, this is the right path for you. Yeah. Then you dis then later on you realize, the the eye, okay, uh -huh. you really wanted to go back yeah. with your, uh, let's say, for example, childhood dream. Yes, correct. But uh -huh. ang importante lang nga, never give up. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, naki may say uban nga once the ano nga pa realize nga ah it's not for me the pagkahuman ma depress yes. diba uh -huh. so it's not really nga da, dapat ma depress you just have to move forward mm -hmm. and then continue diba kay like i'm pretty sure na asa tay mga young individuals watching us today tonight mm -hmm. and then and also parents nga pushing their two year the kids mm -hmm. ah nursing uh, like me my, my my mom really also wanted to make probably young choice niya in life it's nursing kay, mm -hmm. yeah you're right even during the time sa mami na ako, parang nursing na tingay ang sikat. Same experience. Oh, okay. Like, my mother wants to, I uh, wanted to, like, to go to the U.S. Yeah. So, mga day na yun, na siya. Nursing ka, hindi man gina ko feel sa nang nursing. Oh. I tried, I guess, yes. back uh, then. I tried. Uh, you, you also tried I took that. the exam. <laughs> Yeah. Pero, kato lang, uh, it was a uh, timing lang. Yes. Uh -huh. uh, there was an offer for communication major uh -huh. in CNU. Yeah, mm -hmm. but So, Mona, I mean, tag, they lain good kayo ato ang journey. Mm -hmm. But then, what is again important? Nga, you do your best, di ba? And then, kung unsay mo hang haom sa imo ha, then go for it, di ba? True. And then, uh -huh. sa imo hang ni haom sa imo, it's really marketing. Yes. Uh -huh. So, it's really ba like, and going back to like studying um, 
BA in communications. It's fun ba? Tudluan ba sad mo ano mga graphic designs? Uh -oh. Now, on say, nindot sa mata, nga mo, tan -oh, attractive sa mga buyers, ganon. Mm -hmm. uh -oh. So, that's good. Uh -oh. So, like, even at the kalang, appeal pa na ang how to, ano, kanang sa computer, everything. Oh, at that time, yes, it was also the start of doing digit everything digital. Uh -huh. So I think I, if I remember, I started exploring Adobe Photoshop ah, when yeah. the uh -huh. apps back. Wala pa to di pa si katang apps ato nga kanang mugawa ka sa kanang automatic. Yes. Okay. So I did. Uh, I was able to try uh, how to retouch old photos at uh -huh. home. Okay. So scanning mo siya, the process is scanning it and then restoring it slowly uh -huh. with the right amount of color. So, mara dito ka makabantay sa detail, how to make it doesn't look like ng kitapak ra siya. Oh, yes. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Then later on, it evolved into uh, putting things together. Mm -hmm. But, kana siya, it's a different, ano po siya, study. Study. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. But I'm more into the, katong, kanang apron nga si Karat nga. Uh -oh. How to make it nicer, like for example, uh, you don't have an eye, an eyelash, put an eyelash. Okay. Ha -ha. Yeah. Yeah, manual pa to tanan ha, kay by layer pa siya. Yes. <laughs> now, right now, it's just very easy. You just have to click on the app and automatic na. Automatic na. na. Uh -oh. yeah, I think it's also, <laughs> kan, katong mga, inang manual good kay at least even with the details di ba nga ingon ah di, this is it looks original yeah, yeah di ba rather it is than, challenging uh, by uh, said uh, yeah rather than nga automatic lang ibutang ang eyelashes din dili mahao mm, ana ba o oh, nga uy nilampas sa mata dili mao <laughs> yeah ang lead di ba yeah so it's like kama ba sa, sa marketing is there a kwan ba mga ingon ta nga kanang mga rules or mga kuan na kinahangla. Kaya ba siya pagkain na nga na mga bubu in marketing nga mga select design. Kaya I have like read a number of articles nga, uy, this kuan. Di ba? Like in the US, there are also famous na mga fam na mga mga Mar uh, marketing fa mga family nga. It's really they are also into promotions. Mm. They use their program to promote. Di ba? Like uh, mga content creator nga sometimes nga ang, ang kamot unsa ni ay pag edit uy wala nay kamot oh, oh. <laughs> so are there also mga rules nga in that aspect um there are a lot, uh, there are actually a lot mm -hmm. um siya actually <laughs> so, mostly uh, it's actually a semester i, I remember or actually it's uh, learning mga is a lifelong pro, uh, process it doesn't stop so um, one of the things that I can always remember when it comes to marketing is as long if you create a design uh -huh. creatively or any program you have to align it with the story that you wanted uh -huh. to share okay. to everyone right now uh, marketing has evolved so much from the tri media that we know mm -hmm. now isn't uh, everything is in social media okay so uba nagba viral ng mga content which uh -huh. is very very inspiring and mm -hmm. very nice not to discredit nga ko ano sa you have our own judgment man said yes yes <laughs> no, ay, it, they could have done this way if only they've done it this way yes yes mm -mm. yeah but mm -hmm. before tama continue hansiki mo po sa tagpipila ka pa hinumdum stay with us i am one. So, I hope nga nag-enjoy mo sa mga tapi karon Ah, parang di lang day kay tourism. We're talking about marketing. Ah, business. Ah, a Bachelor of Arts in Communications. I'm pretty sure some of the parents there na thinking, on sa kay nindot nga, kurso sa ilang anak to that, to that they can guide their children on what uh, to take up when they uh, go to the university or colleges. So, what's that? Kamo sa diha mga young individuals. Maybe if you're real also good in uh, what you call this in creative design or what you call this digital design or pagkaingon or even storytelling. Okay, na asa din ni storytelling ang marketing. Oh, so yes. kwan kinahanglan yun de kadi. Pero pagag di lang kay kaingon sa design, you also have like a creative mind. Mm. Oh, oh. It's yeah. actually very challenging with attorney sometimes. Okay, you have to connect everything. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, some may not to have, but some are very gifted. Like, uh -huh. uh, uh, mo, 
uh, I acknowledge all the digital creators mm -hmm. who, right now. They're making names for themselves, creating their content, creating their story, yeah. creating the graphics of their um, of their content, and then Correct. posting it online and everything. And it gained a lot of yeah views, views yes. and reach, mm -hmm. followers. Yeah, but uh -oh. sometimes na kita grabi kita nga mo kuan ka, but like mo mo ingo ta ah so it's nonsense, mm -hmm. di ba so? But you know, you know what? Kau na bang ingon nga ay good for them, they're earning, you know. But it's really also a lot of effort. Kay I also maintain my own page. I have my YouTube channel mm -hmm. in Anna. Oh. Pero my gosh, wak pagapon yun ko ka ingon nga kanang singa ni ni prepare good o ka nang si tawagan na mga content for myself kay you know it's so also tiring to do that kay yes yeah before like i do it also like during night time in ana but you know kapoy sa doy di ba so mana mo ingot nga ako i i really also enjoy watching all those content yes, uh -oh. so. kay you also get like lessons yeah mm. yeah, yeah, yeah like mo you get lessons and then ako you also although some are na funny lang o oh. And then, but you know, even those funny things, it made me laugh. You laugh, di ba? Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, kaya nang parang... It entertains. Correct. Mm -hmm. Right. Like, for example, kaya nang lang mga contest-contest, something-something. Oh, oh. Pero, oh, okay, sad. Oh, oh. It's a good idea for Christmas parties. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, oh. And then, like, ikaw sa imo ha, like, in your experience as a, as a marketing person, so, unsa sa mga like, in, in terms of selling, selling a product, unsa sa kayo hang like, gusto mga kwan nga, tanaw ni mo, like, for example, for Cebu, on sa mga nindot nga content for marketing? Oh, Cebu, Cebu City is, uh, particularly have done a very nice, uh, Dili lang nato ibutang marketing content kasi sometimes uh, ako, when, when it comes to marketing is uh, it's really hard selling a word ka Aisha ba it's um it's really creatively done especially whenever there's an event uh -huh. or there are programs right. in tourism yes. so everything is aligned from the de from the design of the poster uh, the the content of the program how it's going to run uh -huh. that's also part of dili lang yung marketing lang siya okay. so uh, overall sa ako ang experience gina check pod na gina check pod na ako, na ako og and my team how well it go uh -huh. so if it really make uh, the people enjoy it uh -huh. So, Cebu City is also doing the same thing, especially yes. with our projects here in SRP. Uh -huh. But you mm -hmm. as a, a, like, as a, like, a Cebuana, ha, ha pang may Cebu ni nga, okay. pang sugar. Na pressure ako. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> pang may Cebu ba? How will you market Cebu City? Oh. So, which aspect ang imuhang gustong i-promote and market? Actually, na promote naman yun siya tanan. Ah. <laughs> Play safe. <Yeah. laughs> well, um, Cebu City is, uh, aside from its culture and history, charit. Oo, oh, oh, pang may Cebu ginada, pang may Cebu. No worries, no worries, no worries. Okay. Um, Ayaw ka guol, walay judge din eh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, Cebu City has a rich history and cultural heritage. Mm -hmm. So, um, it's a good experience to discover the beauty, aside from discovering it over and over again, yeah. to relieve the culture uh -huh. here uh -huh. in Cebu. Yeah, and then like, uh, what's new in Cebu City? Yeah. Uh, okay, being like you're in the marketing, so you know it's also part of the universe. Okay, like mm -hmm. when you, um, I'm pretty sure you also do marketing not only here in the city but also outside. Cebu mm -hmm. and outside the country. So, diba? So, on some end, what's up with Cebu? What's new? Ah, diba? On some way, Mohang, what's new in Cebu City? What's new in Cebu City? Oh, we have a lot of developments uh -huh. in partnership with our private um, com uh, private corporations. Uh -huh. So, which also I belong in yes. Invest. Uh -huh. We have uh, we just uh, reopened our North Coast building mm -hmm. after being challenged because of the pandemic and the typhoon. Mm -hmm. So we also have uh, we are the lo one of the locators in the South Road properties. Uh -huh. So so that, that's that's El Corso. Il Corso. Uh -huh. Il Corso Phil Invest Malls. So why name El Corso? Uh, Il Corso is part of the creative and brand story. Uh -huh. uh, Il Corso in Italy means the course. Ah, okay. The course of the sea. Mm. Uh, so it's a guiding light. It's represented by the lighthouse. That's ah. why if matingalang mga tao, naman ay lighthouse, diya, wami kasabot. 
Yes. Historically, everything in the coastline of Cebu, yes. maybe, di lang kayo sure sa exact location, yeah, yeah, yeah. there's always a lighthouse, but, or what we call the Bantayan Sahari. Yes, correct. Uh, but because the con the concept of our town, of the Phil Invest Township, which is called City de Mare, yes. Il Corso is the uh, the commercial and retail okay. the side of the business uh -huh. of our township. So, ah, uh, so mao din hmm. na El Corso. It's uh, the car, course of, of the, the sea. sea. Yes. So, ang pagkwade, inakot, ang, ang sa ngayon ni, the movements of the waves. Yes, ha? the guiding light uh. to the, well, not just metaphor, uh, not just, uh, uh, literally, nga guiding uh -huh. light sa uh -huh. mga sailors, nga yes, muagi diha, o sa uh -huh. mga airplanes. Yes. But it's also a guiding light in our in our life journey. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. But okay, I saw one post of my uh, friend nga, ang nga din ko, ang nga na na siya, ang lighthouse. Mm -hmm. Ang siya, do you know where is this place? Ganon. Ah, yes. And ko ako, kabalo ko, ang uban asa na, di ba? Yes. So it's something uh, nga, ko ang nga mo, tatak yun ba? Nga, it's really nga, ah, El, da na sa El Corso. Mm -hmm. You're right. In, in uh, pre, before, ah, oh, my goodness, para kung ako'y tigulang ini na, uh, that, to, to guide people sa Zato as sa Shudan sa Subo, prior nga nag na ay South Road properties, um, there was the Kawit Island. Oh, yes. yes. This Kawit Island, it's the quarantine, it was used as a quarantine mm -hmm. um, place before. So, kanang mga, in mga olden times, di ba, kung na mag-pandemic, sa, so, uh, oh. kung mag-pandemic, ilahang ipalayo ang mga tao para, ato, para isolation ba? Oh. Uh, it's an isolation nga place. Um, it's just para isolation island. So, manang Kawit Island. So, the, ang, ang SRP, it's, uh, the reclamation of the Kawit Island. Mm -hmm. And in the Kawit Island, there's the, no, the lighthouse before. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But you know, it's it's been like a no, long time. So, um, tila natin ay kabagyo ang ni Agi. <laughs> mo nang nawagtang, may nang mayo uh -huh. nang gibalik sa mm -hmm. El Corso, ang lighthouse. Yes. It's actually uh -huh. part of the master plan of the design yes. uh, uh, uh -huh. of the township. Okay, across uh, El Corso is a township of City de Mare. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. So, I think there's five buildings already of residential nasa San Remo, mm -mm. who is also our, uh, the one that bringing life to the community mm -mm. sa Il, kasi Il Corso, Phil Invest Malls. Yes, uh, uh -uh. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, and then ba, like, for example, like there, in you as a marketing person, how do you uh, no, market the, that area? Oh, um, uh, what we, <laughs> based, on oh, oh. based on your experience, <laughs> okay. okay. Uh, based on my experience is really to understand the story why we have the Italian-ish, ah, okay. Ita uh, no, not Italian-ish, it's really Italian, uh -huh. uh, mga names, yeah, sa right. mga yes. outdoor features. Uh -huh. We have the Central Piazza Amphitheater, uh, yes, where yes. we have the Stellar, the Dancing Musical Fountain. Oh, yes, yes, yeah. yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Then next to it is we have the Lighthouse, mm -hmm. but we just named it the, the Light, Il Corso Lighthouse. Okay. Uh, okay, to signify that that's also our landmark. Uh -huh. And if you, <laughs> this is the funny thing because people are saying that, what's my swimming pool sa Il Corso? <laughs> 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 actually, that's not a swimming pool. It's actually a... Uh, a creatively um, redesigned concept of uh, the Italian canals. Oh yeah. So we call it the I Canali mm. or the little the little canal. Yeah. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. But it's a wading pool so if you wanted to dip right. your feet. Ah, pwede, pwede. Pero ano lang with caution lang kay slippery ba yung gamay. Yes, correct. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. And it over uh, it it backdrops the Cecilex Bridge from that view. So if yeah. you stand at one corner uh -huh. at the I Canali, you can see the Cecilex Bridge. Ang perfect time niya is sunset and yeah. night time. Oh, oh. Mm -hmm. Bita, okay. Ano, even those people nga who were able to visit, uh, what you call this, Italy, would also like maybe love it because like it's a Mediterranean, mm -hmm. it looks like Mediterranean effect. Mm -hmm. oh, oh. And then parang it's also nice to walk. Okay, you know, during the pandemic, um, it was one of the places nga um, I love to go. Yes. Oh, thank you. Uh -oh. Kay, and in fact, ang akong parents, maritoy akong dad on dito nga at to me mag walking walking. Mm. Uh, and then, it's, uh, and then, you know, it also gained, uh, di ba, kanang traction. <laughs> Kay, yes. now, it's a uh, lot of people going there. Parang mostly sa inyuhang, kwano, inyuhang uh, clientele, parang mga four, 
to down. Yes, uh, sunset time. Sunset. Or, bef- or before sunset up to night time. Yes. Oh, but we don't limit it to those people who wanted to go there for lunch and enjoy the the feel and the breeze of the sea. Yes. Because some of our restaurants are also open, especially the one at the Alfresco area. Yeah. But you mm. know what? Isa pa ninyo nga wala ninyo na, for example, ha, kanang, na what you call this, na maximize the, the sunrise. Oh, we do. Uh, ah, I just, uh, is there is there yes. sunrise breakfast there or the bre- early breakfast? Ah, there are oh. some restaurants who opens for breakfast. Uh-huh. Uh, not every not everyone though at the Alfresco. So we just I want to highlight uh, Matana Chicks Boy, uh-huh. Kumba Heaven, at the food yard, the North Food yeah, Yard, yeah. and then we also have Luminous. Uh-huh. Then Desert Factory follows uh, around yes. six after sunrise. Na. Uh-huh. But and, Mok, you're so blessed because you you're both like you have a good view for the um. The, uh, no, the the, the, uh, then the, yes for the sunrise and then at the back area it's the, uh, no, the, the sun, sunset sunset and mm. we don't miss much of the sunset too because we have we have the reflection of it yes it created uh, vivid colors right. depends on the uh-uh. depends on the faces of the faces ba? yeah uh-uh, of the sun Pita, mm. you know ang um, for me, ha, that area, I, I really discovered it during the pandemic. Yes. I, I, mm-hmm. For so many, like, more, almost two years, I was staying at the NOAA. Uh-uh. Oh, so, we're neighbors. Yes, you are neighbors. Uh-uh. And then, like, ang um, it's like the, the the colors of the sky, really, kind of, like, every day, every night, you have different yes. colors. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And sometimes uh-huh. it inspires you. Yeah. That the uh, not uh, so na, di ba sun, sunset means that in every end there's Ay, always a new beginning. beginning. Uh-huh. Yes. Uh-oh. Sometimes mango, it's also a reflection of our life too. Like if the, something ended, so there's also always a new beginning. Correct, mm-hmm. correct. And then like for example, like when you the aurora borealis in uh, in the northern hemisphere, they have like a colors nila. It's like mostly like green, mm-hmm. orange, ang ato kay red and blue. Yes. Yeah, diba? uh-huh. and then and, uh, a slight of like orange and then koan can in other yellow, diba? So, mm-hmm. when I need it, but I really love that area. Uh-uh. And then Thank it's, you, attorney. Yes, and it's uh-huh. also a uh, good site for during mga sunset cruises. Yes. yes. Yeah, we've been there yes. together. <laughs> uh-huh. yeah. you, we miss the, uh, no, we should try uh, doing the, sunset, uh, the sunrise yoga. Uh-huh. There's a community of sunrise yoga from Ro- Yoga Shala. Uh-huh. Uh, they do that uh, every Sunday morning. What time? Uh, before sunrise, <laughs> five to six. Or empty. actually, before our coastal cleanup, they did it also. Oh, really? Ah, uh, okay. Which we do quarterly. Yes, as part yes. Is, uh, ah, mm. bita kay like for example, og mag uh, magsimbang gabi ka. So after in the simbang gabi, you can just ano do the sunrise yoga. Bring your yoga mat. <laughs> ah, okay, it's a it's, it's a good mm. thing. One, one thing to really quite can ins- uh, encourage us to wake up very early. Yes. Aside from the yoga community, we also have the dragon boat community who uh-huh. always go there every, uh, depending on the schedule and the cur- uh, the the water. Uh-huh. Sometimes okay, the water is ano na, uh, strong, uh, current. Yes. Uh-huh. So when the water is fine, then they do their tra- uh, their dragon boat clinics there with uh-huh. Poseidon Poseidon dragons. Oh. So those who wanted to do dragon boat or wanted to learn dragon boat, uh-huh. you can just check out their page and then you join uh, the clinics either on Saturday or Sunday. Okay. Early morning, you have one. Early morning. Uh-huh. Ah, so at least no, na maximize ang mm. ano ang sunrise. Yes. yes. Wag yun na limtan. Oh, okay. You know, pa dehat na ako sa na. Pero before, like you know, sometimes when things are just there, sometimes you tend to neglect them mm. or like overlook them. But then I realized when we uh, ano the Elcano, the visit of the Elcano during the 500 years of yeah. Christianity celebration, um, agi man diha. Oh, oh, dito na hello picture picture. Yeah, I think you, yes. we were together yes, when we yes. had that. Uh, oh. We had the coastal cleanup that day. It yes. was a double uh, event. Yes, correct. we witnessed that historic uh, moment, yes. and we also have the coastal cleanup. Yeah, mm-hmm. but before sa tama pa dayon with all the mga something to um, inspire us and encourage people to visit Cebu, mo pa sa tagtitila ka pa hinom I am one. Welcome back. I'm 
already shared those uh, watching us from Mindanao or in Leyte. Ako mga friends niya in Inupakan. Hello. And then there in um, Eastern Samar. So, ang ilahasad nga board member, si RV, um, uh, president sa PCL. Um, um, ang ato sa mga friends diha sa Western Visaya. So, maybe it's high time you plan out your visit here in Cebu. And there are so many places to see in the city of Cebu. Bitaw, you know what, kanang Hanski. Parag, you know, some, like, Ako, ako ang tagat taga Cebu Manggil ko, but every day, even when I visit, um, go around, I'm, I still feel kind of amazed on how we, the Cebu City has been transformed. And then, parabagingon ko nga, parabag, parabag every day, I really love Cebu, I love Cebu, I love Cebu, I love Cebu, di ba? Yeah. So, because there's so many kwan places to see, and even nga, mo, anak kadapita sa, kanang new star area nga mo magtan-aw lang ka sa kanang along the shore nga mo tan-aw ka sa city proper even ang sa city hall area lang mo feel ka am I really in a different island a separate mm. island di ba yes. so those things ba nga you feel no, nostalgic di ba and then uh, even in there in uh, El Curso mo kwan ka diya and then you mentioned about Sicilex di ba from there nga it looks so majestic ang mm -hmm. bridge di ba so yeah, it ba? so it's kwan mm -hmm. uh, even ako ka para wag di ko I, I can't have enough of the pictures <laughs> 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 yeah I'm pretty sure ang ato sa mga other Cebuanos also feel the same mm -hmm. and especially ang ato mga visitors yes. di ba so what's up on my WhatsApp in ano El Corso uh, we officially reopened our North Coast building. Okay. This is the building that's right in front of the Aikanali, uh, by the sea uh, uh -huh. restaurants, oh, okay. where Lumin, uh, the stretch of, uh, if, if you'll be at the but the Bay Walk area, uh -huh. you'll see it from Dessert Factory all the way to Fishes, where there's a battleship playground okay. that we also have nga, pa siya ready for the children. But we're fixing it and it will be announced soon. So, ang kana siyang, ang kanang dapit sa, di kay Kukakon, kasi sometimes, when, like, di ba, like, ano ba nga, asa ang north, asa ang south. Ah, yeah. Yes, per per me, per me kumasaag. Okay. So, so, ang kanang, let's say, ang the parilya, it's north. It's part of north. Uh, ah, okay. So, if you stand by the lighthouse, uh -huh. so, uh, Parilla, Parilla, uh -huh. all the way to where the North Food Yard is, okay. that's the north part of the mall. Uh -huh. Then, center naman is Central Piazza, that's why we call it Central ah, Piazza, okay. where Parilla also basically belong. Uh -huh. So, Parilla and Coffee Core, soon yes, to yes, open. Yes, uh -oh. uh, and then in the middle, we have the Dancing Musical Fountain, the All Stellar. Right, right, right. It's Cebu's first Dancing Musical yes, Fountain. Uh -oh. And from there, after Anna, uh -oh. all the way to the South Food Yard where Sutukil by the Bay is, uh -huh. that's where we have the South Food Yard or the South part of the mall. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Kaya parang, you know, parang, ako dako magyunan ko an usay no nindot ilakaw pero usay mga tapulan nagyud kaayo ba marag ako sa su sukad sukad wa pagyugon nakalakaw nga gikan gyud sa front dito sa edge sa north and then going to the south diba it's a it's a long stretch of like a walk let me know if you want to try yeah. <laughs> i do it uh, every other sunset so ah, every other sunset yeah, yeah uh -huh. kay kuan kinang because sa unahan sa like towards like the the tali say, di ba dalhan mas kaya mga food diha, di ba na mas yung mga mga restaurants si mga mga koan like di ba ang sa ang diri sa katuig mong sa sutikil it's really like it's a like it's a stretch, para it's a strip di ba it's a strip nga nasa but in that area did those uh, in ang sa unahan kay di ba naman sa di ba daghan sa food di ba daghan kay mga food ah daghan pog mga food, uh, food restaurants, restaurants dito oo oh, oh. oh, oh. di lang kay di wala pa ko kalabang kaayo ah, okay. i'm here in uh, mandawi city uh, i'm from no, no, mandawi no, no. i'm no, no. city no within your area Ay, sorry, sa el sa el, el cor so yeah oh yes na agyapon uh, yeah. you're referring the if to kill by the bay uh, we have Chef Joshua uh -huh. and Mr. Potato Bistro. Okay. Kana sa hey, ka, ako nakawa na sa El Corso kay di ba? Like, after Parelia, there's still one building there. Oh. And then yeah. after that building, there's another building. Yan ay mga food, ano? Yes. Uh, oh. We call it the Dragon Walk for now. Ah, so the, okay. Mm, because the building is currently under construction. Yes. So we 
Uh, we don't have a name yet, but because the building is called North Coast naman. Uh -oh. So, there is a South Coast, but na, na, we will we'll, ano pa, we'll try to verify the real name of the building. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. uh -oh. Once we finalize, the tenants are partners coming uh -oh. in inside the... Ito, kay, mm -hmm. maragdaghan kay choices on the food, the food. And uh -oh. along that uh, building, uh -oh. on the side by the sea, we have... Uh, Boss Daily, uh -huh. a daily by Boss Coffee, Jipai Chicken, mm -mm. Taiwanese Chicken. Ah, okay. We have AJ Thai, uh -huh. Peace Tree, Miguelitos Ice Cream, and Ramen Sage, and Lemones. Ah, yeah, and mm. then you know, there's also like the vegan restaurant. I the vegan restaurant yes. is in the yeah, north the, side. Yes, uh -huh. north side, yeah. Mm -hmm. So I also like my brother, I uh, know, that's oh. a favorite of my brother. Yeah, it's something yes. uh, for health conscious uh, people or just a health buff. Yes, individual. and then I remember there's also a Mediterranean restaurant. Yeah, we yes. call it uh, Husa Middle Eastern Cuisine. Yes, it's like also like they're selling hummus. Mm. Yes, those who love and uh, try the Mediterranean. And then there's also the one in a, uh, let's say, there's one new restaurant also. The one in facing the, uh, no, the, the dancing Musical. Uh, oh, uh, Joni's. Joni. No, not the chicken. There's so it's also an in parang it's like also Mediterranean something. Mmm. Yeah. It's parang Parilla it's a, it's a, it's a, and Joni's mandapit sa ano sa Picas. Picas. Kadang um kabuyon sa katong sa med katong sa katong Mediterranean restaurant. Oh, ah, uh, that's we call Slate District. Yes. Yeah. Uh -oh. Slate this ah. Uh, Dunkin' Donuts, Slate District. I'm trying to memorize everything. <laughs> Husam, oh. uh, Tandav Street, yes, and uh, Chikaan, and Fisher Seafood and Wine. And yeah. then the other side is where we have uh, CC View and uh, Romantic Baboy. Yeah, like Anasha curved. Uh -uh. Uh, but mm -mm. Kay, kay Kwan, like I also like when when we had like meeting some with the SK. So they do a ah, nice nice place. And kada it's just like also a bar. Oh yeah, that's CC view. Ah, okay, uh, okay. So man, I kaasa man ni. It's right? a rest of bar. Uh -huh. So it's also sometimes mga kita mismo sa Cebu. Mayon asa ni, di ba? Uh -huh. Like kani ba yung asa ni? Kaka picture kina handain tamo adto, di ba? Uh, uh, everybody looks forward for something new. Yes. Uh, uh, experience in terms of food and uh, the entertainment. Yeah, mm -hmm. but kamo sa what's your preparation for the sinulo? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> challenging <laughs> um attorney we are really uh, aligned with the city's um events so for now uh, we are preparing uh in, in partner in, as we talk with our partners we were, were going to have last uh, same as we did last year we also had the sinolog dancers okay. inside the mall uh -huh. so it gave that experience a different experience with our dining tenants mm -hmm. and of course uh, we uh, as we aligned with uh, more events there will be a dragon boat uh, okay. activity oh. right across uh, right by the sea uh -huh. where while we're still while we're having this uh, okay. we're also having meetings on the side yes mm -hmm. and then how about ba, like ang katong inyong port area so inyo pa ba siya gi, gi ano gi revive katong katong di ba na naman mo in say tawag na like katong uh, where the boats can ano like dock oh um katong um, like di ba like one time when we had the um the cruise mm -hmm. also oh, it's still um, there i think it's uh it's still in agreement with uh, Cebu City and uh -huh. the estate Okay. So, uh, right now, I don't have an overseeing for it. Ah, okay. Yeah. Yes. Uh -huh. oh. Then, is it like ang mga tao said ba? Sometimes, like, they, they heard a lot about El Curso, that they can jog and then walk. And mm. Is it really, like, uh, free for all? Kaya mawag yun na yun muna sa mga tao ba? Ah, basin ay bayad, something. Uh, oh. the, the boardwalk is oh. uh, basically free. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Um, we don't, uh, I think the city and us tried not to make it like an eating area okay, to maintain okay. the cleanliness uh -huh. because it's becoming a challenge my God, whenever the, uh, the sea current is bringing trashes from yeah, other, other places, uh, other places. Uh -huh. and it became a highlight sometimes that uh -huh. the, the basura ko no was not taken care of by us, kaya mong But we do, in partnership with the city, we try our best to 
contain all those uh -huh, rubbish. rubbish. Uh -huh. yeah. We just can't control the time when the waves comes in. <laughs> yes, uh -huh. yes. Uh -huh. But uh, that also comes in handy when mm -hmm. during the ano, the International Cleanup Day. Yes, yes when um, the Tri Cities also really the, did their mm -hmm. own uh, cleanup operation because ang dagat nato it's not only di magud na liba, water six its own level so mm -hmm. ang asa ang current ato siya padung yeah. so kung padung ang current gikan sa lain lain nga lugar padung dito sa El Corso <laughs> ang El Corso mga tuga amoy tigsaw sa tuga iya bita so that's a bit, bit also a challenge yeah, it, it's inyo. only if the waves are getting there but yeah. most of the time uh, there's a time of day that everything is perfect uh -uh. Uh, perfect for the families perfect for uh, friends uh -huh. to hang out and walk around yeah and then like going back to marketing is it also part of marketing to come up with events mm. uh -huh. yes. uh -huh. uh -huh. the uh, um uh, marketing uh try to create uh, as part of the of the storytelling mm -hmm. we try to make the events uh meaningful okay so how to, it's just it's not just gonna be a typical prayer opening speech kanang the standardized uh -huh. version yes. of events uh -huh. so we try to incorporate stories uh -huh. that would uh, appeal to our to our uh, audiences okay and would also t tell the story just like what we did when we had the uh, Christmas tree lighting. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. We incorporated local talents. Mm -hmm. So the local talents that we have is from the dance group. We have Cebu Salsa Club. Mm -hmm. Then we also have the Dreamcatchers Live, who made a rendition of oh, the yeah. Wicked uh, performances, uh, musical. Yeah. Then we, the last is we have Kurt Fick. Oh um, yes. Uh, aside uh, from the typical, we uh, sorry for the lack of term, but we we always have mango the choir uh -huh, uh -huh. for Christmas tree lighting. But yes. not to discredit, they are also very good uh, mm -hmm. uh, singers yes. from Angelica Square that day. But uh -huh. mm -hmm. like you know, in in terms of kind of mga corporations, but sometimes like other departments would think ah kind of marketing gasto lang na sila, di ba mo gide <laughs> first gide ba ilara puro na yun na ilahang gasto 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 di ba maginaygan it's also like a like a battle in the corporate world di ba nga ang kuan nga ang uban ah like ang budget department ah no 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 we have to cut down on marketing mga na isan ang sales no you have to support marketing because ah uh, this also are ano a sort of way of making ourselves known so is it also really is it really true ang anong kanasyang da miss conception or conception that uh, marketing is also always gasto 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 um i will uh I, I don't think the word is gasto it's more about um budgeting it in a good sense like mm -hmm. uh, spending it wisely uh -huh. uh, to create uh, meaningful events or for everyone to celebrate uh moments uh -huh. so it, it also happens in our daily life. Like, for example, we wanted to celebrate our birthdays with our friends. Mm -hmm. So we look for the nice restaurant with the view, Baron. So mm -hmm. we have those, uh, the alfresco area. So I notice, I see most uh, P, uh, family and friends celebrating those moments mm -hmm. with us. So it lifts your heart. It's like, wow, this is so nice. So what I'm, what I'm, I'm doing and my team are doing, it's really working. <laughs> yeah, uh -huh. and then is it is it re marketing very important um, to uh, like a company should have um, na na asya yung own marketing team. Um, depending on the requirement that you wish mm. to uh, to uh, to attain, like uh, what goal did you set? Mm -hmm. So if uh, it's a small company starting up. You can always get the uh, ideas of everyone mm -hmm. and how to go about it. Okay. So, does it really have to be like, we need to spend so much for it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, we just have to spend it wisely. I think that's the right, based on my experience, that's the term that I will use. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. Yeah, because mo ni Shay Osahe, like, at the balance in, in, in a mm. business, nga, which is better, di ba? So, de, but how about, like, in terms of my marketing now, is it always now on social media? Uh, we embraced it. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, we are not just sticking to the tri media, the traditional way of doing things mm -hmm. like newspaper advertisement, TV, and radio alone, but we also embrace the social media. Okay, so mm -hmm. you you believe that um, like blogger blogging now it's um, an effective way of marketing 
Yeah, they are actually an instrument of helping out brands uh -huh. uh, to reach, uh, depending on the followers that they have to. So they increased uh -huh. gradually and it also helped the brand be known to everyone. Yeah, okay. But before tamo pa dayon sa tong discussion, uh, vlogging, mo po sa tagpipik lang ka pahinom Stick with us. I am one. So I'm pretty sure you learn more about Cebu City and then maybe you come and plan out your visit here in the city of Cebu. So, but before sa tamo padayon with my guest, Hanski Garcia, ako sa day ingrid, akong co-host, I miss you, Dr. Lucille Mercado. So I hope ka magkita-kita ni Santa Balik. Doc Lucille. But we ako sa din pasalamatan atong technical team, ang atong TLC operators, Indai Lopez, o si Anton Lodibese, switcher Brian Incorporado, cameraman Nilo Cabarles, editor Joan Lopez, and of course, my makeup artist, Farley Katubay. And then, magpasalamat sa ko, migdako ni Tatay Dudong, o ni Nanay Dayan for always supporting our show, and of course, ang ato sang spiritual advisor, Archbishop Jose Palma. So, and then, magpadayon ta sa itong discussion, kay parang um, interesting kayo ang, ang kuan na ito nga. On vlogging, di ba? Sometimes, on sa, alay ka sa vlogging, karon parang daghanagid kayo mag-vlogger. But sad to say, daghan sa kay mga bata noon nga, maghunahuna na lang ako mag-vlogger, di na mo tiba sa eskwela. Mas maayo yun nga. Most, once sa eskwela, you know, it, you, karon it's really things are so changing so mm. fast maybe karon in ang vlogging maybe karon nag income ang vlogging but we do not know what's up in the near future diba and then maybe for four nga ah okay ning vlogging kumaka income white tax oh my goodness karon gipangita na ang mga vloggers sa mga taga BIR kay ilang i-tax diba so those things so Magkuan yun mo, evolve yun tanan. Mm. So maybe, so for now, mapamatouch uh, sa taxes on our, our kuan sa itong BIR, but eventually, nasa'y makuanan. Di ba? Labi nagmanghambog ta. Oy, <laughs> ah, kani, kani. Diba? But you know, sometimes, kanisan ang nasa na sabti, nga ang kaning mga vloggers, they also get freebies, di ba? Oo, oh, oh, nga, mga free. I heard, ang uban ka itong mga sikat na mga vloggers, I heard they get free, ano, free vacation. Mm. Yeah, di ba? So, like, sa inyo hang, kuan, like, do you also, on your part, sa inyo hang company, you also do your own blogging? Um, we don't do our own blogging. Okay. Like, uh, we don't have our in-house, kumbaga, in-house blogger. Uh -huh. Some malls do, di lang ko mention. Uh -huh. <laughs> Some malls do, especially during the height of the pandemic, because yes. that's where we we try to keep up but in our in fill in the smalls with our the ones in the one with our mother mall in Manila, we started doing it but it's more about our employee engagement okay so most of our we are real people uh -huh. with a real experience so we share it why it's good to work with fill in the smalls ah, okay uh, i think that was the content of how we did we didn't just tackle on the selling part <laughs> yeah ah uh -huh. i remember the eye Nga, open na inyong cinema. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. So, how many, ano ba na, inyong cinema? But, let's say, talaga na, theaters ang sa inyo, ha? S cinema. Uh, we have four cinemas, but right now, we are operating two. Okay. So, the, the two that we are operating are the big the big ones. Ah, so, okay. Pilay uh, capacity, ano? 300. Uh, uh, the other one is 200, uh, more or less 300. Okay. Capacity in each of the cinema. Uh, mm -hmm. ah, so, pwede na sa, like, kamo sa diya sa anyo, like, the theaters ninyo, are, are those also available, if ever nga, na mga presentations, school yes. presentations, uh, o, oh, mm -hmm. di ba, kayo, karun, ang mga schools karun, ibalik naman sa yes, lukan ng uh, makimo sila, ka ng ilang drama-drama, di ba? So, so mm. pwede sa na nga venue. Yes. Oh, okay, and we also have an event area at the ground floor where we had yes, a Christmas uh -huh. tree lighting. We call it the atrium. Uh -huh. So, that can cater around 300 to 500 uh, people. Oh, okay. Depending on the setup. <laughs> yeah. And the last but not the least was the popular one, the amphitheater. It's oh, an outdoor, yes. uh -huh. it's an outdoor venue. Yes. That can cater around 800 people. Oh, That's okay. where we had also the last 
prior to the pandemic where we had the fireworks. Oh, yes. Yeah. I remember. <laughs> I remember that was in Gen- 2020. Yeah. Yes, Before January, we yes. were asked to go home. Yes. So that was the highlight when we opened the building. Yeah. So, but because pandemic happened, so we uh-uh. have to go. Yeah, it was so nice. It was, uh, yeah, I was able to also witness that. Mm. It was uh, the fireworks competition during the Sinulog yes. in 2020. Yes. Yes, it mm. was very nice. Um, like, it's spectacular. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, so many, I know, so many uh, events here in Cebu. And then, um, kwa na to ang um, sa El Curso. But other than things, ang mga, unsa pa may mga things that, you know, ano, yeah, sa um, El Corso. But once said no, nga, maybe people will also try and see. Oban mi ni Hanski, ang ka nang mag sunset cruise ka. Uh-oh. Yeah, and then diha nga area ang sa ka nang unsay nga nene, sa El Corso. The, uh, yes, it's a really the pe- coastline. Yes, the coastline is pe- <laughs> picturesque. Mm-hmm. Oh, but para gud chat chat na ka sa Italy. Oh, <laughs> Thank you, attorney. Yeah, feeling feeling feeling. Oh, oh. Credit to my Credit to the team who yeah. created the, or prior to me uh-uh. who created it. With, uh, uh-huh. And maybe Siguro you come up with a competition with a nice picture of. We, oh, yeah. we did uh-huh. before. Uh-huh. Uh, there are some winners. Who, uh-huh. When we opened the cellar last uh, May. Ah, yes, yes. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. We, we also, uh, I think uh, I also invited some. Uh, uh, government officials to yes, attend. Yes, uh-huh. And uh, yeah, they did share their uh, creative, uh, their moments yeah, by uh-oh. the Stellar Fountain. Oh, and yeah. it was nice. Uh-oh. Mm-hmm. And then you know what? Nai, uh, no, nga, uh, case lang papicturan, one of my favorite places, even they has sa, ano, sa um, entrance of to the mall. You can, uh, entrance to the mall, ka nang, naadiha ang ka nang vega. Vegan, ano, oh, uh, the I know the amount drop off. Yes, the drop, building. yes. Uh-huh. Um, there is a palm tree there. Uh, then during sa ano sa kanang sunset, I nindut kena siya nga picture. Yeah. Yeah. Para <laughs> ako pa tingay na ka discover kaya ako na si give up a picture diya. I will yes. check on it. Yeah. In your try it. Media. Try it. Try it. Like it's a really uh-huh. nice view. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's really the one the play facing each other, the sunset. Part. Yes. Uh, yeah. The reflection of the sunset is hitting the lighthouse. Yes. That's uh-huh. what you meant. Yeah. Uh, but with the colors. Quant, yeah. It's really even just for the palm. Uh, okay. Like sometimes you can think, uh, para kag nasa Vegas, the strip. Uh-uh. Mm, I see. Yes. Uh-uh. Mm. But mubo na kaya tong panahon, um, uh, Hanski. So uh, any message to our Tala viewers? And you may invite them to visit El Corso. Attorney Joy, thank you very much for inviting me in your show, The Joy of Women. And uh, hello everyone from Visayas and Mindanao viewers. I'm inviting you to drop by Il Corso Philinvest Malls at the South Road Properties and experience uh, the stellar and uh, um, celebrate everyday moments with us. So with our restaurants and our newly opened, uh, with our reopened mall, um, the North Coast building, and we also have Sunday masses at 4 p.m. Mm-hmm. So yes. thank you so much. Yes, thank you very much, Hanski, for joining me uh, tonight in our show. And then I'm pretty sure the Hanking nakatunan ang mga televiewers. Yes, not only about El Curso, not only about Cebu City, but also about the degree on this um, Bachelor in Arts. Uh, oh no, of arts in um, communications with okay. It's really a lot better for parents out there to guide your more kids on what um, the um, degree or what profession they want to be, and then really that they really love because once they will able to love that degree or course, they will be able to uh, e- easy. They can just uh, um, go, go through and maneuver things and then their journey through life will be very, very fruitful and memorable. So thank you very much for joining me. See you around. Bye. Woman, hear me roar in numbers too big to ignore. And I know too much to go back and pretend.